Get in, get in, get in. I'm, what the? Whoa, 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 wait. He's Stretch Armstrong. Move it, move it. Move it, move it. What's going on, guys? It's myself, Lloydy Dubs, aka Players. We're back with another series of Resident Evil episode number three, Code Veronica. So, in the last video, we've managed to get the steering wheel from that secret weapons room, but we've managed to rescue Steve as he managed to get himself trapped getting those golden guns. I wouldn't be surprised in that one, guys. Right then, let's carry on with episode 3 then, and thank you so much for joining in as well. It'll be much appreciated, but we just got to find out what we have to do next. Never mind Claire Redfield just dancing all over the place while I'm just doing the intro and all that. Okay. Right, so there's an interdiction where the shape of two guns goes. So that's to unlock that door there. Right then. Okay, come on, if Claire can actually get out of the, uh, into the main hall. See, this is what I hate about these damn camera angles, though. But it's a good game, classic, though, so playing this in 2020. Right then, I actually got it now. we got to head over to the training facility there. So what I forgot to do is put this blasted case back. Well, in the storage box, because I'm not going to need it now anyway. But I'm just going to free up some space, though. Right then. Okay. Well, keep hold of the ink ribbons, just in case there's a typewriter in the facility. I really can't remember if there is one or not. It's been years since i played this, so just reliving the 2000 era in 2020. So I really just can't believe this game is 20 years old. Oh my god. It actually did come out on a Dreamcast, and I didn't have a Sega Dreamcast back in the day, but I do actually do remember that time but it got ported over the PlayStation 2 so that's what I got a PlayStation 2 for is to um, play the Resident Evil games that were exclusively on there okay so there's a um, green herb I'm just gonna grab that one yeah because we do need it and there's a red herb you know what? I'm just gonna yeah yeah I'll just take in the green herb I'm just gonna go in that corridor and just grab the red one so we can just mix these two together guys yeah so in back in the main hall of the palace right okay so we go in through this door and just grab what we need I even forgot there was a um, red herb down there it's down here somewhere right that's it there let's mix these two boys up then right then Mix him and her up, and then let's go and combine. So we pretty much stocked up on health. Right, I just keep saying this, but I'm really haunted by Nemesis right now, but he looks kind of different in the remake. Not compared to the original, though. But I will be widely disappointed if it's not a jump scare, like in the Resident Evil 2 remake, when literally just getting haunted by Mr. X. My goodness. Oh dear. Basically, it's nailed down from the inside so we could not open this gate. Wouldn't fancy going in there because it doesn't look too nice. Nah, nothing there. Nothing but a blown up wall, I guess. Well, I would have thought the big gate would open, but obviously it would not. So I'm just going to have to go through this little door then. Okay, okay, no. What the bloody hell? Ah! It's a freaking green digger. What the hell? Get out my freaking face now. You bloody jerk. No. No, 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 no. Get in, get in, get in. I'm weak of powers now. Oh. Oh. 
Oh, oh my god. We've got some bowgun arrows now. Can we even just go in here? Right then. We can't open that door because the doorknob's missing. Basically, it can only be opened from the other side. Okay, something's blowing away. Sounds of the strong wind. No, it's not that, it's a generator. Take the bogan, we should take it. Just in case we need it, there's a file. Um, memo on the pass number. The emergency door lock system, biology experiment room can be released within four digits pass number. I hope you haven't forgotten that about already. Emergency door lock system activating. The door says bio experiment room. Abnormal error. I can't enter the pass number. So it's there's this. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. What the freak's happening? What the? Whoa! 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 Oh my god! No! Ah! Ah! Oh my! Ow! Oh jeez! What the flipping hell was that? Whoa! Wasn't nice. Okay. There appears to be no one around. A red picture is hanging in the back. I can't see the number from here. Right, we better make a run for it. Biohazard contamination detected. Oh my god. Make a run for it, Claire. Make a run for it. Don't even get trapped in. Run, 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 run. Wait! There we go! Ooh! 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 That was close. Yeah, it was close indeed, Claire. It was close indeed, yes. Never mind that noise. Whew! Phew! Okay. Looks like a cola bottle there. I'm just gonna print something out. It's the map. Yeah, so we managed to take the training facility map. Right. Get on it, mate. Get on it. Get on it. Get on it. Get on it. That's it. You better stay down there, boy. Don't even move. We've taken the bowgun arrows. So basically, we, we need a special key to unlock the door. What I'll do is I'll leave the herbs there. We can get them um, later on in the game. But there's other places we've got to go first. Well, before we even go where we just opened the biohazard door, we can actually see what we've got in this room then. Mm -hmm. 
Oh my god, get off, get off. Stupid zombie, stop it. This one can just get a grip on. Stay on there and don't even move. Oh. My god, more bow gun arrows. Oh no, not another one. Well, I didn't want the map open. I'm just gonna. It's a good job I've got plenty of health. I'm just gonna take this. It's just a damn first aid spray. Well, there's nothing of interest in the locker. Oh, there's another. Oh, for God's sake. How many more arrows do we need? Oh dear, that doesn't even look nice. No chance. Just gotta go in this room. It's gotta be the steam room. There is a lot of hot air inside. It's a sauna. That's it. Get some arrows in, mate. Wouldn't fancy taking a dip in there, but I've already have. Just got to shut off the valve. Come on, Claire, you can do it. Do it. Do it, Claire. 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 Okay. What was that down there? What is the key with the tag? We just have to have a look at that. We'll check it. Well, there's nothing else I could see down here. I'm just gonna, like, come out wherever we are then and just go into that office and open the storage locker then. But we'll know what's inside it though. Okay. Yeah, we basically got what we need, so we don't need to go back in here anymore now. My god, shut up with that alarm noise, please. Don't even need it. Right then. Let's open this up then. All of that just for bow gun powder. Only 10 in there. That's about it. That was absolute whack. Just a waste of time just doing that. So where we've opened this door, we just got to go through here. Whoa, what the bloody hell. Something's just closed behind me. Oh my god. Stop pointing that thing at me, Ashford. No. No, get away from me. Out. How did he even get in here? Move it, move it, move it, move it, move it, move it. Don't even shoot, don't even shoot, don't even shoot, don't even shoot, don't even shoot. Get over, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Oh, run away, will ya? My goodness. 
God, my heart is pounding so hard now. You wouldn't just believe it. Oh, yes. Handgun bullets. We're taking them. Right, which way do I go? Which way do I go? Maybe this way or the other way. It's got to be this way then. There's got to be something behind the door. Oh, it's a save room. Ah, okay. We've got the homeostatic medicine then, so we can give it to that guy that's in the cell block. Oh my god. What the freak. Welcome, Claire. I Consider the <laughs> area you are in a special playground I have prepared just for you. Please try and keep me amused, and do not disappoint me by dying too soon. I so want to enjoy this. <laughs> it literally just sounds a bit like Joker. The only way I'm going to get through is this way. My god, what was the heart pounding so loud and fast? Right, okay, so once we defeated this little creature, we're gonna end the episode, but first of all, we're gonna take the submachine guns because Steve is gonna be wanting these. Yeah, we'll take those. I've emptied two blocks out. And there's some ammo for the submachine gun on that crate there. My goodness. Look who's just come. Look who it is. That is not Mr. X. It's Stretch Armstrong. It's a good job I kept this freaking thing. Right, move it, move it! Right then, he's gone. He's gone. Wow. Okay. Somehow that door um, managed to open itself. Whoa! Oh my god. Freaking out. Where did this freaking jerk come from? Go on, Steve, you can save me. Have him, have him, Steve, have him, Steve. That's it. Take him on, take him on, take him on, take him on. <laughs> oh, yeah, that felt good. Don't worry, Claire. Your knight in shining armor is here. Yeah, whatever. You wish, but thanks for the help. See? This is why you need me. I got your back. Whatever. Here, take these. Machine guns? For me? You know the deal, in exchange for your Lugers. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> this thing is too cool. Yes! Now this is my kind of weapon. All right. <laughs> huh? He just realized it's hey, empty. This thing's empty. You cheated me. Up there, plenty of ammo just for you. Way up there? Give me a boost and I'll get it for you. All right, all right. Ow! I got a feeling Steve and Claire fancy each other. Look. Jokes. Up. Probably do. They're having a romantic moment. 
Happy now? What? Now that your knight has made his appearance, he can join you in your descent into death. Okay, now. Okay, let's do it. Wait here, Claire. Time to test out my new toy. <laughs> Right, okay, so we've got a time to test out our new toy. Oh, yes. Okay, that's busted to cold flakes now. You get down there, get down there, get down there. What's he doing? What's he doing? Well, managed to get to play as Steve then. Right, let's have these guys now. Oh, okay, move it. That was so close. Oh. Basically, we can't even open it. Well, it looks like Steve can't get to the workbench. He will have to be me when I play as Claire Redfield again. Wow, look at that. It's bust into cornflakes now. Breaker may fail due to overload. In case of failure, raise the lever as illustrated. The ventilation device will resume operation. Okay, we've got that. But now, we've gone through this door. I'm trying to think what's on the other side now. It was what? dirty work, but this area is now clean. Whatever. See? You can depend on me. You see? This thing is a lot more reliable than any person. Than people? Steve. What were you doing here? Who brought you here and where is your family? Shut up! Steve. Never mind. Let's get going. Where's he gone now? Okay, so this is the sad bit. And that's where we're gonna end it. I can't descend from here. Oh dear! Whoa! Freaking hell. Claire. Are you okay? Steve, behind you! 
Ah, ah, ah. No. Oh my god, this is sad. This is a sad bit of the game. It's Steve's dad. My god, this bit is so emotional. I can't. No. Father! Phew, that was noisy. Shame about his dad. Steve. Father. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Dad I used to work for Umbrella I Tried to steal information Intending to sell it off to the highest bidder He was caught Mom was killed and We were sent here Oh, Steve He was a fool to do something so reckless so stupid. It's okay now. Just rest. Right, okay, so we're back in the game now and we just grab what we need. Before we head back over to the palace. A large size relief. The imagery appears to be telling a legend. That's basically a secret door there. Get off, get off! God, these damn dogs! Okay, let's combine this and reload. And then we're gonna equip it. May as well sort these ones out as well. Thank you! So if we're taking the bow gun arrows, anything else around here that we need, we'll just find. So, only thing we've got to do is get past this grave digger. God damn it. This guy is so creepy. Oh, that was so close. My God, it's those things again. We're just going to go back up here. But look who we're going to encounter first. It's not the one who I'm thinking of now. My god, how did these guys even get in here? Right, that one's down. Oh, get off, get off. Had enough of you already.
Right, thank you so much for watching, guys. That's the episode done right now, and I'll see you all in the next one. Take care, guys. See you all later. Peace, dudes.